Hi, good morning or good evening to everyone. So today's tutorial is about uh, creating or copy a data from one PS file to another PS file. So let's go ahead and see and start. So this is the JCL that we need to write in order to take a or copy from one PS file to another PS file. So IEB Jenner is the IBM provided utility or you can call it as a program so that will help us in copying from one file to another file okay so why do we copy a data from one PS to another file so the one situation is you take you get a data from client and you wanted to take a backup of that file so in that situation you can take a backup so why do you want to take a backup so you if you are processing with the input file the source input file that you receive from client and while processing if any wrong operation has been performed to that source input file so it is hard and it get, it's get updated and it is difficult to get back the original data so if we have the backup of the source or the original then if something happens wrong since we have the backup then we can copy the data from that file to the source and then we can reprocess the process application right so this is how we take or it will help us in taking a backup so IEB Jenner is very very much important and this is very much used when you start working in real time or if anyone is already experienced this I hope this has been used a lot right so since you can understand this mainframes was used from decades so this IB Jenner was there from those many days or years so here is what uh, the steps we need to take here so sysprints is out system or the system defined ED name that is need to be mentioned here in order to check the logs and how it has <laughs> processed and if something happens wrong so system system DD help us to dump what happened uh, so M8 uh, this is my client data or I can see a client information is sending into this data set and here I can go and type this and I can check this okay it has the information related to employee name ID salary and address so I want to take this to backup as employee data backup so before that I want to delete this why because I want to create the data set with the backup okay so now let's go ahead and see so in order to create a backup so I mean in order to copy the data from one PS to one another PS file so the first important point is to check the properties of the source so how do you check the properties just type yes here and you can see the properties like uh, the organization is PS and the record format is fixed block and the record length is 80 bytes then press F9 and then you can see the you can mention the same properties here dataset organization PS record format fixed block 80 and the block size and also the space so once you are done with this and also another DD name that is in the is required for this so now we can submit this JCL just submit and enter so you can see here you go max is zero that means the JCL has been submitted successfully without any issues and it also created a employee data dot backup file press F9 to go back to the previous screen and press F3 press F3 press F3 3.4 to view data set or to list the data set and enter and you can see a backup file is created if you look at the source of properties of the source and the destination you can see the same and you can press browse it when you browse this you can see the information of employee and you can see the same information here so this is how we copy a data from one ps file to another ps file thank you so much for watching this tutorial so if you like this video you can subscribe to my youtube channel for, to get more and more updates on mainframe and you will be posting a lot of videos about all different modules on mainframe and uh, at the same time if you have any comments or suggestions please feel free to do that thank you